I thought Chris threw the ball great. I mean, one pitch. Uh, and it really wasn't a horrible pitch. You know, it was just a slider that got up just a little bit. Um, you know, Encarnacion, uh, Donaldson, Batista, Valencia, those guys all, you know, if they can get their hands extended, they've got, they can hit the ball a long way. You know, when he first hit it, I wasn't sure if it was going to get out. Uh, but it, but he hit it enough to to get it out of the ballpark. And you faced Burley enough. Was that just yeah. vintage? Yeah, it's Burley, you know, and 84, 85, keeps the ball down at the knees, moves the ball in and out, cutters in on your hands, change-ups down and away, and, you know, just um, throws it just about wherever he wants to. What were you seeing as the cause for Finnegan's hiccup there in the ninth? Uh, just, um, you know, kind of fat in the zone, you know, a little bit. Uh, got behind in the count, and then when he came over, you know, when he needed to throw strikes, they, uh, you know, they were up a little bit over the middle of the plate. They weren't really quality strikes. Zach Bunk gets your run in the first inning. In the second, uh, we, was the thinking here, another run or two, but this thing is in. Yeah, no, ne neither. I didn't put the bun on either play. Those guys, you know, again, you know, these guys have a style of play that they like to play. Uh, and. Um, you know, they have confidence in each other. Um, you know, Moose puts the bunt down, uh, knowing that Morales is going to get the runner in. You know, I'm sure Paulo's thinking the same thing. You know, if I can get two runners over, I trust the guys behind me to get guys in and, and pad the score. You know, there are times where I, where I really want to bunt, and there's times where I give them the option. You know, where, you, you know, if you want to bunt, bunt. If you want to swing away, swing away. Uh, it was one of those times. game tomorrow, but I, I just wonder if you're able to just kind of get your arms around what you guys have established in the first half of the season before the All-Star break. What, what, what do you think? Uh, you know, the only thing I think is we've had a good first half. You know, uh, I like everything that we've, we've done. Uh, I think that we still, uh, you know, have a higher ceiling that we can obtain, but that goes in cycles, you know. Um, I like the way that Rios is starting to swing the bat better. Um, which helps Omar swinging the bat better, which helps the bottom half of the lineup. Uh, you know, Moose and Haas have cooled off here a little bit, but they'll get hot again. Esky's hot right now. Uh, Lorenzo Cain's been fantastic all year. So offensively, you know, I like where we're at. I like that we have the ability to grind out wins. Um, I think our starting pitching's been, uh, uh, you, you know, very, very good, and our bullpen's been excellent. So, I, you know, I don't really sit back and dwell on it. I just the, – the inner feeling that I have is we're doing okay. And if you do look at it, you, you maybe haven't had the starting pitching be as good as it's been or, or as it might be. I mean, do you, do you feel like, though, you, for what that has been, it, you guys are really well placed and do you have every reason to expect that to come together more? Yeah, no, I, I mean, I think we're okay. I mean, you take a look at our record, we've got the best winning percentage in the American League. I mean, how – what more do you want? You know, we're doing fine, and we just continue to do what we're doing. We don't have to do anything more. We don't have to do anything less. Just keep doing what we're doing and stay healthy. So. You mentioned this with Rios before. As a veteran player who gets hurt like that, it may take them a little longer to get their swing back. Yeah. It seems to yeah. last, you know, last week or so. Yeah, but yeah, he's been really starting his time. It's mostly timing. And, and, you know, at f when you sit out for six weeks, especially when you break your hand, you lose strength in your hand. Uh, and the more you play, the more strength you get in that hand and the more comfortable it becomes. And um, then your timing starts to come in behind it and you start putting good swings on the ball.